the election coverage on this special election night, 2008. We're so glad you're with us tonight. Uh, we are getting the first results in Washington's general election. Here are the first round of numbers we want to show you. Uh, Washington's gubernatorial rematch between Republican Dino Rossi and Chris Gregoire. Right now, it looks like uh, Governor Gregoire is leading 51% to 49%. KXLY4, Sally Showman and McAllen, both with those campaigns over on the west side. We're going to start with our own uh, Sally Showman, who is at the Bellevue Hyatt. She's with the Dino Rossi campaign tonight. Sally? Robin, the mood is a little bit down right now here in the Republican headquarters. If you pan over, you can see it is just absolutely packed. People have been watching the TVs ever since uh, Obama was called president. And, you know, I saw some people shaking their heads. People just staring at TVs. I've talked to several people who said, you know, the Democrats got their rock star. That's what people are saying here tonight. They said that they expected it, um, but it still is very disappointing. They're hoping that Rossi pulls through tonight, and we're going to have several speakers here. Um, within the next few minutes, Sam Reed is supposed to be the first to take the, the podium within the next few minutes. And Dino Rossi is expected to speak as well, possibly within the next hour as we get some more results. Back to you in the studio. All right, Sally, thanks very much. Live there in Bellevue. We're going to take a look at some numbers now, uh, also around the state of Washington. Uh, US, U.S. House of Representatives in Washington's 5th District, Kathy McMorris Rogers, seeking her third term in office. The incumbent looks like she's going to be winning over, she has won over Dr. Mark May, 62% to 38%. So Kathy McMorris Rogers there, the winner in the 5th District of Washington. And we want to jump across the border now and take a look at some Idaho results. Jim Risch. Uh, is leading right now, 51% to Larry LaRocco's 42%. This is the race, the seat vacated by Senator Larry Craig. Of course, the bathroom sex scandal of last year, which none of us will ever forget. And those are the immediate uh, results, although right now we're still waiting for the final results between Walt Minnick and Bill Sally, the incumbent Bill Sally, uh, taking out Walt Minnick there, 55% to 45%. All right, we have uh, KXLY4's McKay Allen. We talked a little bit about him being with the Governor Gregoire's campaign. We're going to check in with him. We're having a little bit of audio trouble. We'll get with him in our next cut-in coming up in about a half an hour.